Why can we see through glass? Now, you won't believe this if you've just walked into the glass door at a department store, but the good news is that glass is technically a liquid. More specifically, it's a super cooled liquid. When a normal liquid is cooled, it will eventually arrive at a freezing point and suddenly become a solid. But glass doesn't do this. As it cools, it simply becomes stiffer. Believe it or not, the glass in a window pane is actually sinking towards the bottom. Although this is happening so slowly, it would take many millions of years before it formed a puddle on the windowsill. So, to all intents and purposes, glass is a solid. And yet we can see through it, unlike wood or polystyrene, which don't feel as solid as glass. In fact, we don't really see through glass. Light passes through glass to our eyes. Light can be thought of as tiny particles called photons. And when these photons strike a material, they are either absorbed, reflected or transmitted. It all depends on the molecular structure of the material the light hits. Because glass is technically a liquid, the molecules within it are not ordered into regular crystals. They are just randomly scattered about. So, in simple terms, light can just find its way through. In more complex terms, the atoms that make up glass have very low energy levels. To absorb or reflect light, they would have to jump from one energy level to the next, and light simply doesn't have enough oomph to make them jump. So, it just passes straight through. It's worth remembering, though, that we're talking about visible light here. At the invisible ultraviolet end of the spectrum, light does have enough oomph to make the glass atoms jump around. So even plain window glass will block out ultraviolet light. It's why you can't get a suntan in a greenhouse. Oh. By fiddling with the composition of glass and adding other substances, we can block out other parts of the visible light spectrum. Therefore, we end up with sunglasses, stained glass windows, trendy tinted light bulbs in nightclubs, and privacy glass as seen in the car windows of people who aren't in any way famous. Blimey, you're still here. Well, if you enjoyed learning about why glass is see-through, why not subscribe? The button is here. <laughs>